Hello there. Well, it's rubbish weather outside again, so I've got my ring light on, which I hope doesn't affect the video too much. Today, I'm going to chain pull again. I haven't done it for a while, um, and I just love doing it so much, I thought, right, time to give it another go. I've got little canvases to use up, and I've got my metallic colours that I've made up that I want to try. So my base paint has already gone down, it's drippings left over from a previous, previous pour. I have got my tub of water to pop my chains into. I've got various chains, which are stainless steel ball chain. I think 3mm, but I'm not sure, there's 2.5mm there as well. And I've got my colours already down. <coughs> Excuse me wine red, pearl white, metallic pink, metallic turquoise and metallic blue. So I'm just going to put the chains into those colours and I thought I might just stick with the flower patterns this time as I haven't done them for a long time. So I'm actually going to turn my canvas around so that I can do longer lengths of the chain. Okay, I've just <clears throat> had to pull the camera back slightly to allow the canvas in so that I can do this. So now I will begin uh, doing my chain pulls to see what I can make.
Well, I've had fun doing this. Tried to make little flowers, like little, I don't know, pansy type things at the base just to give a front sort of depiction. I haven't done the best job in the world. I'm thinking I might still keep trying. I might just put some more across the front here as I intended to do. Pink and white. I'm just having such a hard time getting, I think the paint might be a bit too runny um, and also far too wet of course, but um, I'll dip it now and see what I can get. That's better. I really need to clear the canvas of what's on there first before I dip and then get a good decent kind of flower going on there. So uh, challenging. But I will just do it, try it a couple more times. I'll clear the deck first from the paint that's on there with the water balloon and then dip and dip. Yes, that seems to be doing it a lot better. So clear that one again because it didn't come out properly and then dip over it again. That's better. See if I can do another little one down here. Hmm. Well, try it again on this end too because I wasn't happy with that one at all. I'll try a red and white one this time. Better. And of course use my straw to blow. Just to blow the, um, the flower out a little, like so. Just to give it that, yeah, more definition. That's better. More what I was looking for. The little little pansy type flowers across the bottom. I'll just do a quick dip with my finger into the middle of that one. Just to give it a little bit of different colour. And possibly a little bit of the turquoise blue. And then the straw. Mm. Not quite what I'm after. Give it a tap and a bit of a tap. Again, that's better. I need to get my flower back. <laughs> oh dear, so much fun trying to do these. And um, yeah, practice, 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 big challenge. Get the colour right. That one's going to be a bit rubbish, but never mind. I will give it a bit of a blow with the straw and uh, that's it. That's it. If I keep fiddling, I will end up making a more of a mess of it. But I'm going to bring it up to the um, camera to show you in a moment what light that I have here, of course. To show you how pretty, I'm very happy with the chain pulls, uh, particularly just doing a, a couple of straight pink and then mixed colours with the others. And the lacing that I have got probably from the uh, white, which was the um, Deco Art Metallic Pearl White. So there we go. Take you around it quickly to see exactly what I've done and the pretty colours and hope that the ring light isn't affecting it too much but that is definitely a, a keeper for me I'm happy with those colours I'm happy that it does actually look like some sort of a flower flower garden or bunch of flowers and that's it for me for my painting for today once again thank you very much for joining me and I'll see you next time